hello guys and welcome back to another video today we are finally back on Balam Road Dairy so we are currently in field 20 and we are starting to make our silage bales so let's get going it has been a, a wee while since I've done Balam Road Dairy farm but I finally go back into the spirit of doing it so I am going to work a plan out on what days are what series so you will see more of Balm Road Dairy in the coming weeks and months maybe maybe not months maybe a few more weeks So, have we produced any bales? There we go, one bale, but that was a, uh, was that a hay bale? Let's go check. Let's see. Oh, it's a grass, was it? I see that. Grass, right. It must be, I thought it was a hay bale that was in it. Just checking. Hmm. Let's see, is there even a bale going about? doesn't seem to be but I thought I thought it had hay in it from before but it must not be so of course this baler is on lease because of course we can never afford one of these balers there's potential we're gonna buy a different baler but I don't know if I want to use it on this series as well because we have we have that baler on Attenham Park so I don't really know but we'll work it out <clears throat> pardon me right ah right I'll take this lovely moor set up back to the farm quickly it's been amazing actually saved us a lot of time there we go about folded up and we'll take it back to the farm for now I think oops did I go the wrong way no I did not going totally the right way it's like me trying to ride a bike again all over again but on a map <laughs> Anyways. Uh, oh jeez. Oh, okay, that was close. Luckily this thing has good brakes. I just realized this is like, I think this is very similar to what we had on Atanum. This one's a bit more powerful. But yeah, it's very similar to what we had. Of course, we sold it and got a much bigger tractor. Park it somewhere, I'm sure there'll be a spot. It's not the biggest yard, but I'm sure I'll find a good spot for it. Um, we never go down the side of it here. So we'll put it down here. I don't like tabbing, but I'm going to do it just to save us a bit of time. I'll go to the left here. Don't know if I've got this on the biggest bell set, and I would hope I did, but knowing me, I could have put on any bell set, and we actually do need to check. Because, yeah, it's a 240, so we're going to have to get the Anderson bell machine, whatever you call it, that makes like bell sausages or bell whatever. trying to decide, I need someone's opinion, do you think this series is growing too fast? 
because we already got a tractor with 224 horsepower. Don't know if you count that as being realistic or no. We seem to be producing quite a good amount of bales. And I'm potentially thinking if I can work it out, because for some reason I've attempted an attempt, maybe I might do a live stream sometime on this map. And it means you'll get to see like behind the scenes and all that sort of stuff. Seems to be quite a good field this anyway. Yields bail wise. Well, we've already produced quite a few bales. I do need to make some hay bales at some point. Don't know if I've got a field ready. Jeez, that's quite a lot of least ions. Be good to get that down. Get all this stuff down. We do need to get a manure spreader. Don't know if it's the right time. 24 grand, let's see. And you get a 15,000 litre capacity. 15, what's that 15,000? 15, yeah, 15,000 with an 18 meter. Well, let's go into manure spreaders quickly. <clears throat> it's a 14 with a 12, right? So, <clears throat> pardon me. That's an 18 with a 12 to 16. That's uh. Six, well, basically 17 to with eight meters. I do like that one, but it's 45 grand. Jeez. I also got this one 21, 12 meters. Jeez. Sorry, I keep saying jeez. Just. It's only 60,000. That is an idea, but at the end of the day, we'll go for what we can afford. It's definitely too big. See, that is an arc in a range, but it's 75,000. For an extra 10 grand, you can get that. See, that is a good possibility. Um, oh, it's a smaller reach, though. So, okay, whatever. Anyway, that's not important right now. This bailing is the most important thing. Just shove that bail out of the way. There we go. remember I haven't played on this map in a while do it yet we do have a bale trailer or we can use that one depends how many we produce let's see you know, where if I have a bale spike on here seems I don't so maybe that's something we can invest get this one, mana two. Yep, mana two. Go for a blue with that bracket color. Um, there we go. And it's made in Britain as well, that's quite good. that 
Right. So that has been bought. Now I need to find my trailer. Well, actually, before I can do that, I need to wrap these bales. So you're probably talking next video. So a few swaths over there to do, but <clears throat> pardon me again. just an idea but this field could turn into a field of wheat or barley maybe just an idea but it's always there <clears throat> pardon me again Ugh, I need to get a drink there we go How much was the baler that I had on the baler that I have on that? And I'm sorry, no, I had. Here it is. I do really like this baler. I suppose. Don't have to get the dealer. Definitely that. 85. I could definitely see a possibility of buying that. Let's hold it off till another few videos and I'll get your opinion down below if you think that I should invest in this. So what? Okay, it's pretty good. We'll see how it goes. Sorry, I keep looking at the store. I'm just trying to keep myself busy. Anyways, back to Balen. Uh, I suppose if we turn these into silage bales, they'll be worth more because grass bales, not really worth as much. I'm just trying to get the memorize what we've had from before. So we had our Ford tractor and our stire stair stire whatever you want to call it <laughs> I don't know why this field does so well because 
I did an on the Atanum series. I had a very good yield in fields and it only produced about 26 bales. Hmm, don't know then. To be fair, that was hay, so hay maybe is not as well produced as um, silage or grass bales, whatever you want to call them. But for now, I think I will use this baler because I just remembered so there's a new DLC coming out and that's basically based on balers, so the DLCs are going to have balers and all that in it. So it could be a good thing to... It might be a good thing to weigh off. Plus we don't really have the money to be spending on a baler. I'm seeing a lot of bailing. Well, I'm seeing bailer quite a lot. <laughs> Every bit we can possible. There we go. I have missed a few bits. Well, the worker, sorry, not me. <clears throat> so, I guess they'll just have to wait till the grass grows next year. We'll go and head down to the store and pick up the, um, whatever you call it, the Anderson sausage baler, or whatever you want to call it. Don't want to make this video too long, but... I also want to get some things done, since I haven't been on this map in a wee while. I'm going to say the, the word again, potentially, we might replace this tractor with something a bit less horsepower. Because a lot of farms maybe wouldn't have a Lamborghini with 224 horsepower actually before we head down to the store let's get the... because I believe yeah it only does up to 220 so, oh, that's for a round what's the difference? why would you... okay <laughs> right um, don't need a license plate. Blue. I do like color blue, so let's go for that. So we'll go and head down to the store. We'll go and pick it up. Oh. Oh. Okay. Actually, we're not going to take this tractor. We're going to find the mana too because we need to pick our bell grab up anyway. Uh, where did I leave it? I haven't been on this map in a while, as I said, so... Um, it'll be somewhere. We do have all these silage bales still, but... The more, the better. Oh, where did I put it? Let's see... Oh, it's already down at the store. Perfect. I'm going to do something unrealistic here. Boom. Haha. <laughs> unrealistic, but quick. Right, so let's this taken to the field and we'll get wrapping 
not music, bells. I don't know if I've ever actually used this for square bells. I suppose there's always something for a first. So you, what's holding up the traffic here? Oh, looks like a forge harvester. Looks like he's had a bit of an accident. Jesus, bad. Of course, those cars can't really go past them because the road shut off. But because we're a farm farmer, we can go past. Actually, the dealer said to us they were delivering a forge harvester on demo. That could potentially be. Hopefully not, because then it's going to be quite damaged when it comes for us. Oh, why do they keep doing that? It's annoying. Me. I'm annoying myself by going into the store menu. Right. In the field we go. And we'll put this in the center of the field. Don't know if I need to. Right, I think we have to start the engine up and unfold that. Right. And of course, we won't be able to put the bales up until they fermented by doing it this way. But it's the only way because we created too big a bales. Too big a bales for your normal wrapper, so we'll just have to do it this way, I suppose. Ah, what? Whoops. Ooh, probably just scratched that machine up. There we go. There we go, another bell. So hopefully this will bring in a good amount of feed for the cows. Since we're gonna sell some of the the round bells. Oh, where did that go? Ah oh it was like it wanted to go on the machine so bad. Well, I've done that again. Oh. Because of me, now that thing is messed up. Ugh. Kind of a bit ugly, that. Uh, let's see if I can sort that. Oh. Did not mean to jump in that. There we go. Anyways. <coughs> Sorry. Sorry about any background noise. Broom, broom, broom. Broom, broom, broom. Oops.
Maybe the stone will drop it in. There we go. Hopefully. That bell has sorted itself. It's not having a fit anymore. Perfect. Do one more bell and then I'm gonna have to end the video there because I don't want to make it boring for any of you. So, which, uh, yeah, we'll go for this bell. it there thanks for watching if you've enjoyed this video please like and subscribe and also leave a comment down below what you've enjoyed and what I need to improve on and also share this video with other people to help the growth of my channel thanks for watching goodbye